Are you ready to start this year off right? One of the most important steps you can take to get your business started on the right foot is to have a plan for the coming year. And if it's not the beginning of the year when you're watching this, don't worry, there's never a bad time to make a business plan. In today's video, I'm gonna be sharing the four essential steps to planning for your business. By the way, I'm Mariah and my business is Bloom Hustle Grow. I help service-based entrepreneurs get their business operations organized and optimized to make the hustle happier. Find a new video here each Monday to help you make your hustle happier. So make sure to hit subscribe. Now let's get started. Step one, pick an overarching North Star goal for your business. For many businesses, this can be money related or time related, like doubling your income or working 30 hours a week. But it doesn't have to be. Find something that will help keep you motivated and on track. Essentially, this goal should be what you weigh all your strategic business decisions against. For example, my goal was to work less and spend more time with my family. Then choosing a visibility strategy of speaking at conferences might not be the best match for me because it goes against that core goal. This really can be anything you want, but it does need to be big enough and overarching to keep your business on track. If you're having trouble thinking of something, just go with an income goal or a revenue goal. Those are generally kind of the easiest ones for people to connect to. Step two is evaluate your current business strategies and operations. Basically, you want to capitalize on what's working and get rid of, fix, or minimize what's not working. Let's go back to step one and say my goal is to sell $2,000 per month in digital product. When I evaluate my current business operations, I'm going to ask myself, what can I capitalize on that will help me reach this goal? What do I need to get rid of to make time for this goal? And what new strategies, systems, and projects do I need to tackle in the coming year to reach this goal? So I know that Pinterest is my number one social media website traffic driver. I would ask myself, how can I better leverage that strategy to reach my $2,000 per month goal in digital products? What kind of steps would I take or change there to better utilize that particular channel because I know it already works for my business? Step three is brain dump it all. Just get it all down on paper. It can be as messy as you want it to be. Basically revisit step one and step two and just brain dump all the things. So essentially you want to write out all the things that you think you need to do or change about your business to reach that goal in step one. So what do you need to make this project or projects happen that might be associated with that goal? What tech software, what hiring help might you need? What kind of content might you need to develop? What do you maybe need to learn or develop your skills around? And how am I going to make time to make this happen? Just brain dump all of these things associated with this larger goal out on a piece of paper or in a Google Doc, wherever you feel comfortable brain dumping. And then what you want to do is organize that information. So step four is plan it out. And what I do is I break up my year into four quarters and it's three months each quarter. So that's January, February, March, and so on. I would just roughly have an idea of when I'm going to tackle stuff. So if I know that my goal is to sell digital products, but I only have like one digital product and I don't think that's going to be enough for me to reach that goal, then in quarter one, I'm going to work on developing those new products. And then maybe quarter two is where I focus on actually marketing. And in quarter three, I might say I'm going to develop another product or refine my email marketing or pursue a different marketing channel. So I would just kind of rough out like where those major focuses are in each quarter. Then what I do is I plan out in detail for 90 days at a time in my business. So while I have an overarching plan for the year, I actually detail out what I'm going to do in quarter one. I don't necessarily detail out what I'm going to do in quarter two, but I may say, you know, quarter two is marketing folk and address it then. For quarter one, I would write in more detail to develop a new digital product. I need graphics. I need to record video. I need, you know, all of those steps that I need to take to get that product up and running so it's ready to market in quarter two. And that would be my focus and my goal for quarter one. And I would go into detail about how I'm gonna make time for that and where I'm going to focus my time in quarter one 
for this project. Join me next week and we're going to dive into how I put together a 90 day plan for my business and some of those core features of what I look at for that 90 day plan where I detail out more of my projects. I hope these four steps give you a little clarity on how you can start planning for your business. Again, you want an overarching larger goal. You want to evaluate what's working and what's not working in your business. You want to brain dump all the things related to how are you going to get to that goal in step one and then and plan it out. Make a more detailed plan of how you're going to make time to do this thing for your business that's going to take it to the next level.